everybody, welcome to Bloodstain Ritual of the Night. This is your favorite host, Aaron, with my special guest, Kiki. Wow. She is currently visiting, which is why I'm not getting as much YouTube stuff done. Well, gee, thanks. Well, no, it's my own fault, because I'm just not doing it, because I'm too busy spending time with you. Ah. Alright, so I just got the demo code for the E3 version of Bloodstain and Ritual of the Night. Oh, we've both been kind of excited for this for quite a while. Uh, for those of you that don't know, this is from the original creator of uh, Castlevania. And basically, Konami didn't want to make the games anymore. So they said, fuck Konami. We'll go make our own game with blackjack and hookers. Maybe without the blackjack and hookers. And uh, so this was crowdfunded. Like a lot of games have been lately. <laughs> but, it actually really exceeded its um, funding too. Oh yeah. So we're going to give this a try and see how this looks. I have not played this at all yet. Fair warning. Okay. Back step. Okay. Good to know. Yeah, it's very 3D modeling. But it's set in like a 2D type side scrolling. Yeah. Which I like. It's like the original Castlevania. Search. Okay. Open the menu. Oh! Okay, so you can hold the jump button to get a little bit more air. Okay, so how. What? Ha! Okay, let's see what we got here. Longsword. Equipment. Longsword. Alright, my attack went up. Now I got a sword. The turning animation is actually really nice. I like how the my scarf has a little particle effect coming off of it. Not a whole lot of controls yet for me to use, but we'll, we'll get more, I'm sure. Oop, another light. I'm gonna break all the lights. Hi, you're ugly. Nice. He's a, blo a slime blob. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <it wasn't> <laughs> okay, so that lets me see the map. That's interesting. It looks like there's a spot here. What? Can't I get up here? Is he good enough? Well, like, it looks like a spot I can stand in. There's a hole up there, but the map shows nothing. Hold on. Maybe I need to, like, bounce off an enemy head? There it is. Come here. Come here, ugly. Is there a downer attack? Hmm. No, where? Hey, get... Maybe that's just not something you can do in, in the beta. The demo? The demo, yeah. I don't think this beta is just demo. Oh yeah. It feels pretty good. Oh, what? Oh, a little bit of wall clipping there. Yeah. Okay, so that's to fall back through into the previous room. What do we got? Potion! Break all the things! Ooh, a hundred gold. Tentacles! One of the things that's interesting in these type of games, and it was in the old Castlevania games, was that you can kill enemies and gain powers from them. That's... So I'm going to try to get the powers from every enemy in the game. In this death uh, Depends on how long it takes them to cough up their powers. Either that or it's on the random number generator. Oh, hey, I just got it. 
shards. Demon power is that uh, it's been crystallized. It can be handled by an ordinary person. Cerulean splash. Shard infused with the Sientma's power shoots whirlpool. Okay. Oh! Ha! Okay, so I got their power. One enemy down. It helps when they just keep spawning like that. I probably don't want to use up all my mana just with this one power. Oh! Ooh! Level up! More armor. Just a regular tunic. Long shirt made from simple cloth. Breastplate made from tan cowhide. Okay, so there's different scarves. Heat retaining scarf. I'm gonna guess that's good if you're fighting cold enemies. Oh! Destructible environment? And there's a potion in it. Now I'm gonna have to... Now it's gonna be like Dark Souls. I'm gonna hit every wall. Okay, so he's dead. Uh, simple headdress used to hold the hair back. That that is the description of a headband. Uh, I might find it. I might wait till I get some easier way of fighting, and then I might grind that big guy for whatever power he might have. Flying enemies, I hate flying enemies. <laughs> Got him. Break all the lanterns. Another potion. It'd be cool if uh, some of the enemies would drop like weapons. I don't know if they do. The power turns into a crystal weapon that just stabs into herself. Oh, Fire okay. cannon. Shoot flames from a demon possessed cannon. Okay. Shard. Okay. Hmm, that's a cannon and boom. Haha! -ha. Aku seems like a generic enemy, but even he's gotta drop something. I don't know what his power would be, though. Oh, jeez. Well, that was... Let's go try to kill them again. Tell if there is or not. These guys were not nice enough to drop power. But I want their power, whatever it might be. 
Okay, I have more range with this sword than I think I do. Oh! No, that's a level up, darn it. Sorry guys, I'm sure that seeing me grind enemies is so much entertainment, but uh, I just really want to get whatever these guys might drop. I... Chances are in a... I don't know how much backtracking I'll be able to do in some areas. Like this is like tutorial area, so I don't know if you can backtrack here. And I don't know how many of the enemies will make a comeback. So I hate to miss out, uh, when, especially when we get to the actual game, because I will be doing it on the channel. But I wouldn't want to miss out on uh, cool powers. You've... The jerk went through the wall. <laughs> there he is. Darn it. really far to the low. <laughs> Slime guys popping up on the ceiling is not going to help you. Slime guy power, I don't have the big guy power. I don't have the floating orb power. These guys are dying really easy now. shoes. Uh, it's a little bit more damage. Okay, sure, why not? I'm Chung Lee from Street Fighter. Haha. <laughs> I think I got slightly less range than I did with the sword. Which makes sense, but... I am one-shotting these guys with... Well, I was one-shotting them before with the sword. Oh! Ah, gosh dang it. I am doing more damage, though, so... Uh, is there a door? Aha! Uh -huh, a door. Let's see if I can get a power off this guy. Come on. No. I need to use potions. Yeah. Uh, oh, there's a level up. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, his power. Yes. What is it? Head flail. Use the head... Uh... The Headless Knight as a flail. Okay, how do I... Oh, go to shards. Okay, let's see how this looks. Okay, so it's a melee attack.
pretty powerful melee attack at that. That I find much more useful. There's no wall running. Hey, it's you again. You never gave me your power. Still didn't give me your power. Okay, rolling enemies are not my friend. The pinwheels from Dark Souls have taught me that. Dang it, drop your power. Yeah, but that flail one seems like it could be useful, because that's mid-range. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's a yellow one. Con booster increases con. Enchant shard automatically activate buff by attaching a shard. Okay, so this isn't an attack shard. Uh, increases constitution. What does constitution do for me? There's no way for me to see like stats, is there, right now? I mean, it could work out kind of like how you use constitution. Well, that, yeah, that would make it health. Um, that would have helped that I pay attention to my health before I got that. Oh well. Okay, so I think the only thing I haven't got a power from is those little floating fire things. Oh crud! Oh well. I don't care about you anymore, I have your power. That's true. Squid Man! Squid Man. Whoa! Whoa! Hi! Ow! Big ugly face in the wall? Ow! You! You guys are seriously being jerks. I already have your power, so ha. Uh, I just get stabbed even if I still have- even if I already have the power. Potion. Yeah, I, I'm actually, I'm really liking this so far. <laughs> Just kick his head with the clean off is hilarious. I mean. Oh, I need your power. Ow. I'll hit you with your own head. That's kind of sad, they're... Actually, sure. They're swinging around their own head as a weapon. But not at least know what they are, they're headless knights. Okay. Oh, here they are again. Darn it. Give me your... Ah. Flying enemies, I swear. <laughs> Come here, you. They tend to be. Okay, back in here. Back out here. Darn it. Back here. Darn it. Fine. While I'm waiting for you to come back, I'll kill your friend. Oh, jeez. He came back with a vengeance. There. Oh, still didn't give me his power. Still didn't give me his power. Darn it. Missed that. We traded hits, but I won. They're being real jerks and not giving me their power. Oh, hold on. I never got these chests. Ooh, a ring. Oh, it increases my defense. A ring increases my defense. Why not? Okay, unbreakable walls here. I'm gonna have to figure out, like, I'm gonna need to go back later and try to see what the indicator for a broken, a breaking wall is. 
Because I hope it's not just random. Because that's really annoying. Because uh, a lot of times there's some sort of indicator. Unless it's Dark Souls, then good luck. guys so I've been at this for a little bit and these guys haven't dropped their power I don't know if it's just a rare drop or what but I guess uh, we'll just continue on uh, looks like there's a path over here for the fun of it just because I was kind of irritated with them for not dropping me anything. It would have been, and I kind of would have been very okay with it. <laughs> Alright, but I guess I don't get their power this time. I don't know if maybe those guys just don't drop it for some reason. Oh well, hopefully I can get the power whenever the actual game comes out. And again, I might play this demo a few times because it's pretty fun. Haha! But I feel like I might have missed something. is a fancy looking door. Screams, I don't want to go that way yet. Being able to kick through walls is weird. Oops. High potion. Okay, so high potion, uh, fancy potions outside of a funky looking wall, uh, door, that's never a good sign. Let's kick this line. Oh! Oh, it was just a fill up for my energy. Uh, let's. Don't worry. Okay. Alright, so I got one small potion and one big potion left for this. Cutscene. Tentacle, again. Whoa! Jeez. And her stomach has a face, because that's not weird at all. I kick you! Oh wow. So I thought they were all gonna stay up there. Spike ball will get in his head. Hey! Oh! A bluff! Woo! 
Ah, oh, there's the end of the demo. Darn. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Alright. So, that was a lot of fun. Kinda wish I could've got the powers from that slime ball. I mean, that slime creature and the fire head, the flying fire thing. But, maybe I can get them later. Maybe. Yeah, I'll be doing a full... I'll, I'll try to do a full Let's Play of this game whenever it comes out. Well, you were one of the backers, so you, so you should get it when it comes out. Yeah. Yeah, I am find myself looking forward to this. I haven't got to play too many uh, Castlevania or style games. I, I was kind of excited for Mighty Number no. 9, but that one just... All the stuff that went on around that game just really kind of lost me. I do technically have already bought it, but I haven't even played it yet, and I... Yeah, have to move just to get a refund for it and put the money toward some other game. Well, I don't know. We'll see what I do. Um, I want to thank you all for watching this demo. And if there's any problems with the game itself, remember it is a demo. The full game. I can't remember when. I don't think they've announced the full game yet, have they? I don't think they announced when it's coming. Yeah. But. If Future Me knows when the um, uh, release date is, he'll put it on the screen now. But, uh, I want to thank you all for watching this. Have a good rest of the day. This is the two of us, signing out. Bye! Bye.